I'm here in Hobart to visit Tasmania and to work here at the Continence Foundation Conference on Incontinence. I'm speaking mainly about nocturnal symptoms, so patients that have to wake up at night, patients that leak at night or bed wet at night. The biggest challenges in my field of interest is that patients need one year before they come to a healthcare professional with their problem. And the reason is partially coping. If your husband snores, you will try to cope with it. And it's only when it really becomes a problem that you will go and visit the doctor. And then the next step is that the patient must find the courage and go behind taboos. And that all takes quickly a year. And then the next step is that the healthcare professional should do the right thing immediately. And if he doesn't, you lose confidence and patients get lost. My patients with nocturnal symptoms, incontinence or not, the major improvement that I would like to see is they don't have to fill in bladder diaries. Because it's time consuming, nobody likes doing it, doctors don't like looking into it, so if we would have a tool to do that automated or pass by the problem, that would for me really be an ad advantage. Well, I work as a functional urologist and neurourologist since '94 in, in Ghent, and um, my research topics are sacral neuromodulation, so neuromodulating our brain, our spine, to improve our symptoms. And this can be done with medication, this can be done with devices, this can be done with botulinum toxin. And with the years, a second topic came in, and that's nocturnal symptoms. So patients that leak when going to the bathroom at night, patients that go too often to the bathroom, or patients that have bedwetting.